Hi, John Walker from Lakad TV. Now, I love pineapples, and I have a question. Can $8 change the way that you eat? Let me introduce to you the pineapple core. Now, previously, you probably used a knife or seen people cut a pineapple for nice, and it can be really hard to do, and it takes a lot of time. But with this pineapple core, you can core a pineapple, you can cut it, have beautiful spiral slices of pineapple, and I would say under five minutes. And the pineapple core only costs about $8. You probably can find it online for less than $8. I'll provide a link to the pineapple core down below. Now, just a point about the pineapples we have in our area. They come primarily from Costa Rica. And you can buy pineapples, fresh pineapples, at any grocery store, Costco, Sam's Club, or BJ's. I like Costco because they're nice, big pineapples. Now, one point about buying pineapples in Hawaii, if you buy a box and bring them back, the airline will not charge you a luggage fee for the box of pineapples. It's the Aloha Spirit, and there is no charge for bringing back a box of pineapples from Hawaii. If you take a look at it, you notice it has two pieces. One is the handle, which comes out. You have to take the handle out when you take the pineapple out. The bottom, you notice, it has two sets of teeth. One to cut the center around the core of the pineapple, and the other tooth is used to spiral the pineapple, to cut into the flesh of the pineapple, the fruit, and it produces a beautiful spiral, much like a spiral ham, or some of you might have a spiral cutter for an apple. This is how the core works. Now the first step is to remove the top. Grab the pineapple, just twist the top, and it comes right off. Now if you want to grow the pineapple, you use the top, you just twist it off. What you do is you remove some of the bottom leaves till you see the root nodules, then just place it in water. In time it will grow roots, then you transplant it into a pot. Pineapple upside down. Because normally it's sweeter at the bottom, but allowing the juice to flow to the top will make the top just as sweet as the bottom once you cut the pineapple. Now we're going to wash the pineapple to remove any loose dirt or debris because when we get the juice from the pineapple, we don't want to get any dirt into the juice when we pour it. Now we're ready to cut the top of the pineapple. We'll just move back maybe one nodule and we'll cut the top of the, off the pineapple, a straight cut. Now it's time to core the pineapple. Two pieces, we put the core together, we put it in the center of the pineapple and we start turning. As we turn down, when you get close to the bottom or when you hit the bottom of the pineapple, it'll just spin freely. Once we get all the way down, we stop and then we pull the core up out. As you pull it up out, you'll see the beautiful spiral. Once you get it all the way out, we'll take the core apart. Now we take it apart, we take the top off, we turn it upside down and put the pineapple in our container. In the bottom of the pineapple, there's juice. A big pineapple will have a lot. Take the juice and what I do is I pour the juice into a glass. Also around the pineapple, there's excess uh, pineapple you can cut very easy with a knife and I'll show you how. Okay, we poured the fresh juice in the glass. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut the pineapple to get the pineapple off of the side, the little bit that's remaining from the core. First thing that you have to do is you have to cut that core out. So slice the pineapple in two all the way, cut the core out. Now you have the core out, pour any juice in the glass. Now pour that in the glass too, cut the pineapple in two. And here we go, we'll cut the bottom off the pineapple. And now we'll just take the knife and go around. Remember a big pineapple, there'll be a lot. Even a little pineapple, there's enough. Squeeze any remaining juice into the glass. And there you have it, we do it for each. If you're in a rush, you may not want to do this. Uh, or if it's a small pineapple, there may not be that much left. But I really like to save as much juice as possible. There you have it. 
core and the pineapple. Now let me show you a bigger pineapple. Now this is a bigger pineapple from Costco. You'll see how there's a lot more around the core. That's what I mean when you cut a big pineapple, you definitely want to get that pineapple that will otherwise be wasted if you only core the pineapple. But boy, this was really a big, beautiful pineapple. Watch as I core it. You'll see when it's cored, the core goes all the way in. So notice how tall this pineapple was almost to the top of the core this nice big pineapple and look when I pull it out it's so nice and yellow look at that and juicy take it apart you got to rinse your hands a lot look at the pineapple look at inside see the thickness around the edges you definitely want to get that pineapple for knife you cut it just like I did the other pineapple and there you have it this beautiful pineapple i'm going to put it into the container just like the other one notice it almost fills the container and just how wonderful yes that for pineapple eight dollars you can change the way you eat you can have fresh pineapple every day in fact at a picnic you'll probably be the only one with fresh pineapple john walker for Laka tv thank you for watching please give it a thumbs up subscribe and check out my youtube channel